There's a normal genetic variation in people of African and Middle Eastern descent that impacts white blood cell count and could be leading to unnecessary medical testing. My name is Joel, the medical mythbuster, and let's talk about the Duffy Null phenotype, previously known as benign ethnic neutropenia. The Duffy Null phenotype is an adaptation that helps to protect against malaria. It also causes lower neutrophil levels in people of African and Middle Eastern descent, impacting nearly two-thirds of the black population of the United States and two-thirds of people with African or Middle Eastern ancestry. Neutrophil levels are typically used to determine a person's risk of infection. Lower neutrophil levels usually means increased risk of infection or can indicate a condition like leukemia. But here's the interesting thing. Having the Duffy Null phenotype means you can have a lower level of neutrophils without an increased risk of infection. Because neutrophil ranges are primarily based on data from people of European and Asian descent, what ends up happening is many Duffy Null patients are referred to specialists for low neutrophil counts, even though it's normal. That leads to unnecessary, expensive, painful, and invasive testing like bone marrow biopsies to make sure these people don't have blood cancers. Studies like this one from 2003 even say that this could be a reason why black patients get less chemotherapy for early stage breast cancer. Not having inclusive neutrophil counts that include the Duffy Null phenotype perpetuates systemic racism. It can lead to delayed or discontinued chemotherapy and medication, clinical trial exclusion, and unnecessary medical procedures. As of May 2024, the American Society of Hematology is doing research into potentially redefining the absolute neutrophil counts for people.